More children in Indiana are going hungry. Many kids aren't sure where their next meal is coming from. That's according to data just released today from the Indiana Youth Institute's Kids Count Data Book. And as WRTV's Caitlin Kendall shows us, members of our community are trying to help children in many ways, starting with getting them fed. Learning in school. Say it's a vital part of childhood development. But focusing in the classroom isn't the only thing many Hoosier kids are worrying about. We had an increase in the number of kids with child food insecurity. Indiana Youth Institute's Kids Count Data Book is 240 pages long. In it, data shows one in five kids were food insecure in 2020, meaning they weren't sure where or even when their next meal would come. And it's a, it's a huge, huge issue for our young people. And a shocking one in three households with children reported their kids weren't eating enough because food was unaffordable. It's crushing. How can a child reach their full potential when they're struggling in this moment just to feed and have their next meal. Food insecurity is something many people and organizations work to fight. People like Kelvin Jarrett. He's a teacher and director of School Kids Academy on the east side of Indianapolis. Being honest and realistic, we may be the only place that that child gets three, three good solid meals a day. Jarrett does his part to provide food for his students, prepping meals. We don't want anyone to go home hungry. Working to ensure all of their bellies are full. She had apple sauce and fries. A two thumbs up for today's meal. Jarrett says they make sure all of them are given enough food in case they don't get any at home. It's just our responsibility as child care centers, as schools, you know, and as also neighbors to make sure that everyone is getting the food that they, they should be getting. His reaction to the data? That's a pretty big number. Uh, it's very disturbing to hear that because that just makes this program much more important, that we are serving kids, we are giving them a good, healthy meal because we just don't know. Working for you. Caitlin Kendall, WRTV. We will have the entire data book posted in this story at WRTV.com. And information from the organization Feeding America shows that one in seven children in our state face hunger. One in eight people overall face hunger. On the website FeedingAmerica.org, there is a list of food banks all throughout Indiana. Again, that website is FeedingAmerica.org and just click on Indiana.